Hi, I'm Amanda and I'm here today with Josh, an estimator at Retrofoam of Michigan. Josh, a concern that homeowners have is if there's formaldehyde in retrofoam injection foam or in isonine spray foam. Well, that's a very valid question. Uh, a long time ago, uh, you'll hear horror stories about houses that were done with a very thick formaldehyde base. Um, foam has come a long way since then. Um, there is a trace of formaldehyde in a retrofoam product. But that will dissipate as we're mixing it in our hoppers in the trailer. By the time the retro foam hits your walls, it is classified as environmentally green with, with no formaldehyde. The spray foam, the isonine that we carry, has not a trace of it in there at all. Completely 100% environmentally green. All right, perfect. Thank you so much. You're welcome.